actually gonna be there in a very busy night and this music playing on top of me so I don't know how the audio is gonna sound but hopefully I try to do my best so after the eight years located at 540 Rochester Street a couple blocks down from Farinella Pizza they started in Ottawa 12 years ago and this year completely rechanged the way they do the tasting menu. Starting from all blind tasting menu to 44 courses, which takes along four hours. A couple minutes ago, he be walking through this room where this 44 tasting menu actually originated from. And the idea is similar to Alice in the Wonderland, where the scene is when Alice comes into this room and she has like, endless amount of meal and this big long table this is the feeling that's supposed to happen tonight and i'm very excited so far i'm doing the full menu with the full wine pairing and i'm very excited to do and this is going to be one of the best meals of my life which we'll see and it's also my birthday weekend so i can't so i'm very excited i'm treating myself this amazing meal our cartofata. Cartofata refers to the toast that we put the ingredients in. Yeah. This is mussels with white wine, fennel, leeks, and tarragon. Okay. So the, the classic couch is good to cook up to 400 degrees. Okay. Yeah. So it is an evolution of the French cooking style of en papillot. Oh, so like, like a, a wrap, like exactly. Yeah. yeah. So when you open it up, it's going to release all the aromatics mm. and it's a really nice smell. Nice. Here we have our chestini pasta, okay. filled with potato and caramelized shallots. Wow. With a cote cheese sauce and a three-year-old balsamic, as well as some fried shallots on top of it. Okay. Our curing project, which the QR code is just underneath, just underneath the pasta. Okay. Is a smoked Lake Erie walleye mm -hmm. with a lemon and sumac tea and some buckwheat groats. Groats, also known as buckwheat seeds. Wow. You'll see the little crunch there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And that is a buckwheat leaf on top of there. Buckwheat leaf. Wow. Here we have a smoked avocado puree with miso flavored nori chips. Wow. Our snail caviar on a beet chip with miso pea puree and lavender gel. Here we have our first guessing game of the evening. These are two <laughs> different flavored bags of potato chips. Okay. So it'll be up to you to guess what flavors you Oh, wow. Okay. Here are ahi tuna wrapped in bitter lettuce with cilantro, puri, and pickled ginger. Okay. And our bread course tonight. Is sriracha focaccia. Sriracha focaccia. Yeah. So, have, go ahead. I have three or four more dishes to bring you. Okay. And that'll be the first wave, we call it. Okay, first wave, okay. It's the most amount of dishes on the table at one time. Okay, okay, okay. So, I'll wait for it then. <laughs> Guys, look at this. You guys can definitely see this video. So this is a focaccia here. Smoke avocado. I don't know what this is, but this looks really good. Um, this looks like a pasta dish right here. This is mussels wrapped. In a, in a paper bag. I don't yeah, know what this is. I forgot what his name is. I think this is like the buckwheat. And he has three more that he's bringing to us. Wow. Here we have a cryo blanched Santenay carrot. Okay. So we blanched it in liquid nitrogen. Oh, wow. So it's actually frozen. Okay. That makes sense. Because it gets so cold that it's almost it's like hot. So it minus 200 degrees. And so then we uh, roasted it. And then a nasturtium puree and a ghost pepper mayo. Wow, okay. So ghost pepper mayo, just right here, is on the spicy side. So if you're not great with spices, try a little bit to start. Yeah. But yeah, and then some fried carrot tops on top. Oh, nice. Here we have one of my personal favorites. Wow, this is beautiful. Crispy carrot hoop. Wow. With lime compressed apples, curry pearls, lemongrass crumble, and a coconut gel. Coconut gel, oh, yeah, wow. So the coconut gel is just the white creamy that you see. Yeah. And then the pearls, the yellow sort of, you see there, yeah, the yellow. Yeah. So that's liquid nitrogen frozen curry pearls. So we, we made like a curry puree. Yeah. And then just dropped it in liquid nitrogen. Oh, wow. Frozen pearls. That's incredible. And, and the hoop is like, that's carrot, right? That, you is, said? that is the carrot. Yeah, yeah. So wow. If you, uh, it's you right here. Link this, this um, QR code here. Yeah. It brings it to a YouTube video showing you how we make it. Wow, that's so cool. And so then you can even show your friends as well. That's awesome. And here we have our PEI Lucky Lime Oysters with Nuwak Cham Gel and fermented cucumber. Okay. Nuwak Cham is a traditional Vietnamese sauce made with lime, cilantro, and fish sauce. 
Yeah, so wow, okay. So this is the first wave. First wave. Guys, you guys need to see this first wave of food I just got here. I love mussels, and I'm starting out with first right now, and I'm very excited to start with it first. Oh, this smells so good. Guys, this smells delicious. Wow. Guys, this smells so good right now. Mmm, wow. Good. The mussels, fantastic. I'm gonna drink this juice. Mm. I'm trying to smoke avocado now, and I don't know what this is again. I'm gonna have to ask. It looks like it's like fried seaweed, huh? Let me try it out. Whoa. That's smoked avocado, and this is so good. Is this, is this seaweed? Wow. This is fried seaweed. Mm. That smoked avocado, I want to marry it. It's like, so how do you smoke avocado? But it's like, he took the avocado and just makes it something completely different. Like, like, I wish, it's like cheesy almost. That fried seaweed, perfect crunch structure. And I hope I'm, I'm picking up this crunch. There's a lot of noise here, but... Oh my god. Let me try the sriracha. Focaccia. Mmm. It's good. I'm gonna take some of this. I'm gonna take some of the smoke. Avocado. So I just took some of the smoked avocado and I put it on the focaccia bread. Oh my. Now I'm trying that Italian dish. So gorgeous right here. I'm gonna one bite it. This looks really good right here. For the table, as QR codes, and from the QR codes, you can know how they actually make each dish. That's actually very smart. I'm making a bit of a champagne right here. Man, this looks such a gorgeous dish right here. Hope, hope, hope you guys can see this. This is so gorgeous. This looks so cute. I don't want to eat it. Apparently, they put this carrot in nitrogen. The scarab right here is an anchor Let's try to start a song. Whoa. I'm gonna try the carrot. I'm gonna try this carrot now. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Okay, this is good. How cute this one is. Like, I almost don't want to eat it. Look how cute it is. Man, it's like a little wrist scratch right there. Wow, this oyster looks really good. We had it. How cool this one looks. It's like a hoop. The hoop's a carrot. And those are like curry pods right here. What the heck? How the heck did they do that? Like, how the heck did they do that? Because, like, look at this. Bruh. That's a carrot. Like, I don't want to eat it. It looks, looks like a piece of art.
this right here, that's the carrot. I don't know how to explain how it tastes. This is beyond my understanding of food. So apparently these, apparently these are like flavored chips. And I have to guess which flavor they are. So I'm gonna try this one right here. Oh, this looks so good. It's like chips right here. What kind of texture is that? Whoa. Mm. This actually pairs very well with soccer, actually. This is another Mr. one they gave us. Let's try this one out. Ooh. Look at this. This, this, this is different. This is curry. This this is curry. I'm gonna wait for him to come back so I can like see if I'm right. But one of them is curry. This other one is like dried fish. You to you about the chips? Yeah, they told me they're um, they're like mystery chips, right? Yeah, yeah. So one of them is a curry for sure, right? Okay. The other one, it's like dried fish from Japan. I forgot okay. forgot the name of it. Do you, what do you like, know? Um, they they put it a lot on like noodles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, Bully for face, yeah. yeah. That was delicious, yeah, by that the way. Hey, don't worry, your computer didn't crash. This is the end of part one. Part two and part three will be posted soon. Like the video, subscribe to my channel, tell your friends and family. In the meanwhile, check out my other videos.